Hey guys, it's Lindsay, and welcome back to another video. Um, as you can see, I am very festive today. I got my little Santa hat on. I got some uh, Santa socks on. Um, because I am filming a Christmas video. This week's video, or this video, I guess. I'm do I'm <laughs> what? I am going over my Christmas wish list. It seems to be trending on YouTube right now, so I figured, why not? Let's make one. Um, also, I'm sorry about my voice. I'm kind of sick right now, and I just wanted to put this video out there for you guys. It's okay. I got my Ricola. I got my tea right here. This peppermint tea. Very good. And this mug. You can see me get this mug for my birthday in my birthday haul. You should go check that video out. Um, but yeah, let's get into it. Every year, my uh, relatives always ask me for a Christmas like wish list, I guess. So I, I never really made one till last year. And, you know, it seemed to get a lot of things that I wanted, basically, because I made that wish list. So I made a new one this year. And this is what's on that wish list. Okay, so the first one is a uh, Canon EOS T3i or T6i. No, I am most likely not going to get this gift just because it's so expensive. And, you know, I'm, I'm using my mom's camera, which is pretty good quality so far. It's mostly because I just want a camera of my own, I guess, so I can use this camera for YouTube and for taking pictures because I'm really into photography. Um, and for Europe, like, I can take this camera for Europe when I go to Europe. But, I mean, it's so expensive. The camera's so expensive. And dance right now is so expensive. So, the reality is probably not going to happen. The next thing is a Diva Light. Diva? Yes, a Diva Light. So, I want a Diva Light because, well, right now I'm using natural light. It, it gives me a very, like, small time frame to make YouTube videos in to, like, have good lighting. So for Diva Light, I can like film whenever. Like I don't have to constrain myself to like one o'clock to three o'clock is like my time frame. It's, it's annoying. I can't film at any other time unless I'm like vlogging or something. Yeah, Diva Light would be so nice because you don't have to worry about that time strain and that for that lighting. Okay, so I said gift cards mostly because I just want new clothes. I'm such a shopaholic. Like it drives me crazy. Yeah, I just want to keep up with the trends. You know, keep that Instagram popping. The next thing I said, um, journals. Now, I got journals for my birthday already. I honestly haven't figured out a way to write in them yet because I know it's going to be imperfect, but I just, I have this feeling I just want them to be so perfect. So I'm trying to plan out how to write in my journal, but honestly, I need to get over that. I want to get into journaling. So I have two journals that can start me. So this really isn't like a necessity like right now for me but you know it's always good to have journals so like when you're done with the journal you just move on to the next one next thing is the modern renaissance palette Ugh. honestly kind of like out of season i guess or like out of trend but oh i love this palette it's all the shades i like to use in my makeup it's got like browns pinks oranges like maroon reddish yeah i just feel like i would use this palette so so freaking much plus it's just so pretty and the name is like aesthetically pleasing and the packaging is aesthetically pleasing next thing is polaroid film i have a polaroid but i quickly ran out of film like two years ago so the last polaroid that i took was two years ago it's kind of expensive at the same time so i just just put it down it's not a necessity in my life but if you have a polaroid you should have the option to use it you know i haven't been able to use it in two years okay so the next thing i put down is just kind of like anything car related. This is mostly because I'm a new driver this year. I turned 16, I got my license. I just told my relatives like, since I am like new to driving, you can like, just anything car related, I guess like air fresheners, which I already got for my birthday. I don't know, keychains, I guess. <laughs> car stuff, I don't know, I don't know. My relatives, they're just older and more experienced drivers. So whatever they feel like I need for me to be driving, like, why not? The next thing is candles. I am obsessed <laughs> with candles it's actually a problem i have a drawer full of candles like some of them i just take for my parents because i like the smell of them yeah i like to set candles or hmm? you turn on candles what do you what do you say i like to bring fire to the candle <laughs> i like to use candles um when i like need to calm down or like if i'm stressed about homework i'll turn on a candle sure i'll turn on a candle do my homework like to calm me down I, like have this nice smell like this What's it called? Like aroma, I guess. I just adding to my candle collection, I guess. That's just just nice to put down. And plus, like, you can't go wrong with a candle gift. 
especially for me. So the next thing that I put down is a David Dobrik merch. Well, I don't have any like David Dobrik merch. The only like merch that I have from a YouTuber is Dolan Twins. Ugh, big surprise. Yeah, I really like his shirt stuff and they're always like changing and he's always adding new stuff, which I always want, but I never have money to get it. So I just put down like the link be like whatever whatever like I like all his stuff anyway next four things are actually shoes the next thing is low white converse low top white converse well okay so I have the high top black converse right now in the past I had the high top white converse which were really 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 in at the moment but then they got a little dirty and I never wore them again the thing about like high top things I feel like they make my legs so stubby they shorten them off and um I don't know, they've been looking a little bit unflattering to me. So I would really, really like low top converse. Just kind of like like vans, you know, they accentuate your legs, they make them look longer. It's just so casual that it's trendy, you know, and it goes with everything. So it's just, just a basic. Next thing is checkered vans. Now this is not a basic. This is definitely a staple that I fell in love with. Um, in the trend world. I really, really, really like the look of like checkered vans. I think they look really good with um, just trying to like urbanize your outfit, you know, like make it a little bit more Tumblr. Um, also, it looks good for like that like California vibe. California? What? <laughs> California vibe. That's, the, that's just the feeling that it gets me and I love California. Next thing is the Adidas All-Stars. These are very expensive. Well, to me at least. Yeah, everyone that I know and their moms has Adidas All-Stars. And I, they're, they're very old, I guess, now in the trend world. But I still like them. I still like the look of them. And maybe maybe even get them like in different colors, like blush. I really like the blush ones. But yeah, I think honestly it's like a trend that has turned into a basic. Okay, the next thing that I want are these books called Milk and Honey and Oh, The Sun and Her Flowers. And these books are by uh, Rupi Kaur. Rupi Kaur, is that how you say it? But they're like poetry books. So um, it's poetry all written by her. And she put them in these two books. I got this idea from my friend, my friend Gracie. She has these books. Honestly, they look very aesthetically pleasing. So that's one reason. But also, I just want to get more into reading and like stimulating my brain without having to like go on TV or... YouTube, ironically. The next thing that I want is the Rose Gold Beats headphones. Um, okay, so the link that I put down is like wireless, but they do not at all have to be wireless. Honestly, like my Beats just broke and I want a new pair of Beats because they're so good and aesthetically pleasing. You can hear me say that a lot, actually. Aesthetically pleasing, yes, yes they are. The Rose Gold is just yeah, I, I just need a new pair of headphones, so I figured, you know what, let's just go big, let's just go luxury, and see see what happens. Okay, the next thing, oh my gosh, this is so good. Next thing is Lululemon leggings. Okay, so these leggings I have on right now, sorry this bunch of dog hair, but these are from Iviva, which is like the sister brand, but they're so worn out, because I've had them for over a year. I see a new pair of leggings, and Lululemon like, if you want a pair of leggings, you, you have to go to Lululemon. Like, there's no other place that you can go to get good quality leggings. And plus, you know, if you rip them, they'll replace them for free. Next thing is the Dolan Twin merch. Actually, I don't know if I can do this anymore because their Dolan Twin merch is it's all sold out. I really, really like, I'll show you a picture, but I really, really like the um, white hoodie that they're selling. You got the Ethan and then this and then Grayson and then... This, oh, that was on my list, but I don't know if it's gonna happen now because it's all sold out. Oh, and that is everything that I put down on my Christmas list this year. And again, I'm not really like expecting any of it. Honestly, this year I kind of went on the expensive side of things. I don't know, like I'm kind of appealing to more luxury stuff, even though I have absolutely no money to get it. But it's, I mean, just just make your grandma get it. It's fine. But honestly, I'm just, I'm just happy that they want to see what I want to see, what I want for Christmas, you know? So that's the main reason why I do that. Not to be like, this, 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 and this is what I want, you know? Like, don't get me anything else. And honestly, at the very end of this uh, little document that I made, it has, like, it has a little excerpt saying, uh, like, I'm not expecting anything, so if you don't want to get me any of this stuff, like, I put lists of, like, my interests, so it'd be more 
even more inspired to get what I want, I guess. I'm really excited for Christmas this year. I'm going to Alabama, which I will be vlogging, and it's going to be really fun. This is the side of the family where I have more cousins and more aunts and more family. And I haven't seen them in a really long time, so I'm really, 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 really excited. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you leave a like if you like this video or comment down below anything that you'd want from my list because my list is amazing. Uh, thank you for bearing with me with my sick voice. Yeah. See you guys next time. Jingle down, goes down, goes down, goes down, goes down, goes down, goes down. Piano in the bell, 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 b